For many travelers, it is still summer. You often see the big RVs rumbling down the I-80 with out-of-state plates. And for senior citizens, a really good deal has a few days left. A lifetime pass is about to jump in price. Reporter Nick Starling on the rush to get the bargain before it's gone. It's a pretty good deal, just $10 if you're over the age of 62 to visit any national park in the United States for the rest of your life. But that price raises to $80 on Monday, which is why so many people here are in line to get that deal before the price spikes. Here we are. I got it. I got it in time. This pass of a lifetime is special for Karen Bakewell because she's just now eligible to get it. My birthday was yesterday and so we thought we should stop down here and get it. We're on our way to visit my daughter in Minnesota. We like to travel. But her husband, on the other hand, is out of luck because his 62nd birthday is next month. Being older, pay this time. It's this deal that has hundreds of seniors lining up to explore the most beautiful parts of the United States. Maybe like the Rocky Mountains or you know, there, there's different uh, monuments. National uh, monuments, battlegrounds, uh, yeah. Grand Canyon, Yellowstone. But the time to get this deal is running out. On Monday, this same pass will cost $80. We're saving 70 bucks, uh, and, uh, and you know, we're on fixed income, most of us. Money is on the mind for Charlie Money getting in on this $10 deal. Well, you know, save a buck. Uh, you know, even though my last name is Money, uh, it's nice to save a buck. The demand is so high. Yesterday, the Park Service here sold over 480 passes. Today, over 900. We are expecting to run out of passes, but we will be having a voucher that uh, guests can fill out and then pay for it, and we will mail them the pass. While this may be just a card, it's what it will get you into that will bring memories that will also last a lifetime. So we're going to start using it. We're lucky we got in on this. It's a deal now because I know it's going to change. Now, if you couldn't get here today, no worries. This place is open this weekend before that Monday deadline. We'll also have a link on our website on how you can purchase yours online as well. Reporting in Omaha, Nick Starling, 3 News Now.